<laughs> uh, the, every, every movement you see, it starts from, start from the word of. Okay? It's because everyone they have one movement and it's a killing. In olden time, when you practice very well, it's a killing. Because, for example, the word of, the, okay, punch, punch. And that's the neck go off immediately, okay? This is the word off. That is, uh, it move, that's it. It's a one movement. So one you block, you go right away. That is a, the word of, word of left and right. And that is the way, because all the movement, there's only eight movement, and eight forces. Every movement and eight forces, there are no more than that. So you apply those things. So like, like the press, and you have the press, down, huh! so you go right from here, and that's the ribcage and the liver, okay? Huh! It goes right there in there, because there's the water, and there's the press, the press. And you do it, when you fast enough, you, you're banking with the whole body, okay? The rib is, the rib is gone, the rib case and the liver, because the whole impact of the Tai Chi going in, okay? Now the single rib is, is, is a very, you so much in everything, okay? And um, the single rib, Sometimes we call it a dirty one. <laughs> it's a dirty one, okay? So, it moves, you see? <laughs> because this is go right into it, or here, the bigger whip, this is painful, you know? Boom, right in there. So a dirty one, but <laughs> when you're in a fighting, then no dirty or not dirty. <laughs> you get the guy down, that's it. <laughs> and, and that is the, and the whip is, uh, is very dangerous because, it's okay. You knock out the teeth. From here up, here is the strongest one than this. So you go this way, or you go this way in a temple bone, or you go this way in a temple bone, or you go well, now this knock the here. Is, so the whip is anything, okay? Whip is done like this. Left and right, up and down, left and right, front and back. That's all. Whip. So if if I block him, I go back, that's the one I end this. <laughs> go right. <laughs> that's why the whip. And this and this movement. Actually, is the, uh, uh, the this move, this one, the big, is the famous movie of Q, Q Bill, Q Bill. And the uh, the master teach the student, it take the eye, and he take the eye of the student, and the student come back and take the eye of the master, <laughs> so one eye out, <laughs> and. And that is Bill. And later on, he teaches a new, new student, and it much better, and it's the lady, just to break the heart. Break the heart and take the heart out. And that is called Kill Bill. The whole movie is called Kill Bill. That's it. And that's the big, the only the big. So the big on the eye, the big on the throat, the big, Hit the brake and come in. <laughs> That's how the big, that is a Q view. This whole thing is the big. Yeah. And it's very dangerous because you, 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 you train this power, you hold the hand like this, you train the power like that. Okay? And you hit like, like woodpecker, tick, 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 then make a hole in the wood. <laughs> tick, 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 every day. <laughs> if you can make a hole in the wood, you get it. <laughs> the eye gone. <laughs> and that's what the. The, the, the single whip. Single whip is very dangerous because everywhere you use the single whip. Everywhere you use the single whip. And you can, you can focus in five finger in one point because in between the rib cage, if you focus on a point, you break them. Okay? Like a big. So the, 
I saw one move. I, I saw one historic in the in the, the historic movie uh, about the most powerful killer is the the olden time the bird, and the big is so big, okay, and they kill everyone, even the tiger, even the lion, they kill them all, because the big is so big, he go around around around. <laughs> In the head, that's it. Because the beak is so big, it's the bird. They, they, they're running on the floor, like, like, the, like the, uh, the emu, like the, all this bird. They're so big. And the beak is so big. And, and they're running up to that, and they poke on the head, they're gone. That's all they do. And it's very dangerous, but they're all distinct. <laughs> you know? and, uh, what they have in history is that is the beak. Okay, and so that is all the, the movement. And you're the eight forces, you see? You're the eight forces. Okay, so when he's too aggressive on pushing me, I push him upward, I get him down. So that's simple eight forces. So you have, you have word off, you have push, okay? And you have, we call upward force. When he push me, I get him, I guide his force upward, and I update him. A guy for our, uh, I update him from here, he go. So the eight forces, so eight, four. And you have the shoulder strike is terrible. So I bang on his, his chest, the shoulder strike. Okay, and elbow strike is terrible, don't do it. <laughs> okay, the elbow strike. So when you push me, go right then right into the, in the chin. We got the elbow strike, elbow strike, elbow strike. So that's the elbow, so eight forces. So every move is the daily killing. Because in the Second World War, the China used this to fight and kill Japan. So this form, when they go in, just no mercy, boom. Okay, <laughs> I mean, they, so you have to go at night when they sleep and <laughs> fight them, you know, with a knife and with this, and they fight. Because the gunpowder, you, you cannot fight them. And, and you have, so all these things, you see, you have the push. So you, the push, you go down, and go up, okay, and go up, so the force, okay. Because the banging on it, because it's the use of the body, you use the whole body movement. Huh! So that is the part two. You use the whole body movement. Huh! It's like a truck hit you. So the Tai Chi is using the body like a truck, hitting in and transfer the power to the end. So there's a whole form you have to learn. But the first step that we test you, only the form, okay, for the teacher. But this one you need a little bit more time to learn the, the application and how to use it and the eight forces. Okay. And this one, uh, they train in olden time. You just train one movement. You just train 100,000, a million times until you feel your body move together with the force. And that's all. And when it hit, like a truck, boom. Okay? And that's what the, the whole form. It's simple. It's simple. But once you get it, you can, you can see the whole impact. Okay? Because in the part two, you learn So you have four direction. You have four direction. You block the hand and right in. Or you going down and you come up, you block the leg and go right into the guy. Boom. That's it. And the guy fly. <laughs> because if you sing, they kick, you come out and you go in. So that's why the so there are only few movements, not, not more. This is the major movement. Everything, you block everything, and you go. You go with the whole body, go right in. And with the force. 
So when you have the momentum plus the speed, you go right into the moment the guy fly. Yeah. So that's why the the Tai Chi, Tai Chi you see them slow, but the daily. When you get the impact force, when you get this, so that's always go with a, a dragon and tiger song. So you move the whole body. You move the whole body. Okay? And that's why you need to do, you need to do this. And when you get this, now you move the sliding the whole body impact. The whole body force go right in part the speed, you get the power. So that we got half step. Half step force. Half step force. Half step force. You have to get this half step force. So you slide the whole body and you use the earth power, move the whole body as a piece. You have, if you move as a piece, it's different from the hand. Hand have limit. But if I move the earth and the structure and I hit like truck, hitting it, that's all. Okay. So that's why you, when you understand the form, the form is very practical because it's four direction form. Okay? Thank you. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, what a, so now let's, <laughs> now let's go this part, the energy part, see? So you see, you push, now you see, push, second push a little bit, lumbar, thoracic, out. So you first time you sing, Sing and push the power, push the power upward. No, push the power, push the power upward, push the power upward, and out. That's it. That's how, that's how this one. You are using the ground power plus your spinal cord plus your body and plus the hand. Now you get the power out. Okay, so that's why. It's just like, you know, I watch uh, uh, the Mike Tyson boxing. I tell you, he learned a lot from the Chinese martial art. And all he boxing is from here. That's it, that's it, <laughs> no, that's it, <clears throat> from here. But the other boxing is from here. They're fast, but one is going boom, boom, from here from all the grounding and all the body, and when you go in, boom, boom, very short punch. And nobody, nobody gonna fight him, you know? Because he punch so much from here. From the dantian and the weight and the body. And you do that, if very short punch, not, not this kind of upper part punch. But his force is coming from here. So he learned a lot from martial art, especially the Chinese martial art, you know? And, he, uh, and that's why nobody, <laughs> if, you can, if you can last him first or second or third round, you're okay. He gets exhausted and tired. <laughs> and, uh, okay, so, so go this way. Feel the power from below, coming up and coming out. Okay, so you get a partner, how you feel the power, feel the power, push, pushing up. It's just like, you just push, you push yourself to the front and get the power from the front, uh, uh, the ground out. It's like, a, when you can feel the spinal cord like a wave of power going up. Okay, it touched me here. So, okay, you have to press your leg and move it upward. And you feel the energy go upward. You like an arrow go this way. So from the ground, come up to the sacrum, lumbar, and the thoracic. So from here, and it go up this way. Okay? And you have to, not like this. There's no power there. You have to relax your upper part and feel the power from the ground 
going upward and going outward. And when you get it, it's the mind. You feel energy move. Relax, you feel you're breathing to the energy. Push and pull. Okay?